Alright guys, welcome back. Legatone in here. Uh, welcome uh, to a new mod pack uh, that I've been playing. Uh, in a single player world of course, by myself. Let me check. Yeah. As you can see, I've uh, made a little bit of progress. A little bit because I thought I was recording. My freaking recording software did not record when I click the hotkeys, so it didn't record the progress I, I had up till now. What I have here in my inventory, and also the progression here on my advancements, which is pretty stupid. So to sum it all up, I did. I was. I spawned right there. I walked mm. through right here gather up some plant twine created some I mean plant fibers and crafted some twine and then gathered up some gravel right there and some clay as well and then crafted the gravel with the grass fiber mesh to get flint and one tip when you're breaking flint, don't break it on this side of the block. Also, don't spam click it. Just like a little bit of intervals, like 0.5 second interval. Yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4. Or, as you can see there on the. What do you call this? Uh, I forgot the word for it. This thing. And as you can see, there was a bar right there. Until that's gone. You can like, keep left clicking. Until you get more flaked flint. Also, we are gonna need a lot of rocks as well. To make for later. Also. I really spawned in a really nice pile, huh? Get this. Ah. Uh, and really short render distance as well. Well, it doesn't matter. So first, we're gonna craft some. Not some. We're gonna craft a flint hatchet. Dun dun dun. Caveman hatred. How did I even get that? I didn't even break. I, mean, I think you get that after breaking a tree. Eh, that's fine. Let's kill this black bear as well. I'm gonna need its bear claws. Because. Getting five of them will be you'll be able to craft a bear claw paxel. Oh, well, it's still unfamiliar to me, so let's just keep progressing it until we'll be able to do so. So let's get some wood as well. And from what you can see here on my inventory. Here on my GEI, these are all the things that I can craft right now because of the advancements. You need to progress all of it so that you'll be able to craft stuff. You know, the more you go through the advancements, the more you'll be able to get more crafting recipes. The more you get more crafting recipes. Better. Let's try to kill this. Oh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Not too close. Not too close. Kill these things. Oh, yeah. They have nice meat. Also, bear claws. I really hate when the bear claws don't have textures on my mod pack. 
so all right and this should be in our crafting yeah it's unlocking some new recipes right now because I just uh, crafted that work stone so let's wait for a bit oh. dun 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 right now it doesn't show here on my inventory but if I go back we have now four more pages which means we can craft more stuff and also get to eat these <clears throat> got that Ooh. we now we are now a little bit more smarter to be able to craft and eat this stuff now let's eat this apple we kind of low on health oh yeah once you've got through the advancements you'll be able to get a crafting rock which is crafted by a simple rock so right now all we need to do is find a place to call home in this case this spot oops and it's these things these things are useful if you want to set up defense around your base or in this case in front of you yeah, I can't break this stuff yet. <coughs> I don't have ra the right tools, but maybe we can uh, stay right up there. <coughs> Since I'm a caveman, it's logical to live in a cave. Don't you think so? Before I do that, let's go do this. This is a trick <coughs> I learned from other YouTubers. You just uh hold right click just spam left click that way you can you know gather uh what do you call this mm, the planks easily while you're you know chopping them Let's put that and uh, let's get some more stuff on this one. Is this what I think it is? Oh no. It's just a yellow. It's not it's not the mulberry sap that I need. It. I might need in the very future. As I said, I mean, I didn't say in this recording. I played this a little bit in my single player world. Not a lot, not a bit. Actually, a lot. I think I'm. I was now. I'm now at age three in that world. Yeah, H3, which means, yeah, I've opened a lot of stuff. So, uh, since my flint hatchet is near broken, you, have, you can repair it using, f what? Oh, cannot be repaired. I guess we're going to use a much, much better uh, version of that hatchet which is the axe I think that's not it that. it's this one flint axe so that's uh oh I think I'm gonna need gravel let's go get some gravel yeah uh -huh. let's salt Let's gravel I don't even need a lot more than this. I need to find a gravel deposit or something. Alright, the 
let's get enough. Blocking my way. Oh yeah, let's uh, use this till it's all broken. Good, good, good. Now we can. All right, craft. Nope. There. To get more flint. That. That. To craft the axe. Let's write that. And uh, you can't really get a crafting table set first right now it's because we need to we need to get to the next age to be able to get that so first oops not that oh it's almost night we gotta do this fast so that we'll be able to what they call this uh make a cave home okay that's how you do it so we can make Spam right click as well so that it'll you know craft seriously can't repair it. I guess it's only the axis version that I can't repair. Well let's go ahead and make a what they call this a pickaxe. I think it's like this, this that an upgrade. And from what we can see here, we can craft stone tools as well, but I prefer to use this uh, flint tools because it mines, uh, mining speed is 5.0, unlike stone it is 4.0, which uh, feels much more slower than that, than this. As well, need uh, since we're still we're not smart enough, we can't really make a proper chest. The only chest we can make right now is like this: a rock in the middle and planks on the side. Yeah, you remember. Forever stranded, this type of chest is kind of boring and kind of annoying as well. Neat. I'm gonna tell you a tip as well for this thing. You can right click to put the items aside, but there's another way as well. You can left click on the occupied spot. Let's see here. Let's put this and see. There, occupied spot, right click, and then left click with another item. It will automatically sort it out for you just any spot of it and it will put it there for you all right hope it's there uh, there let's go ahead and make another one as well Ugh, I really hate this If you're noticing some stuff, I put my gamma way up so that I'll be able to see much more clearly on night. And it's for you guys as well, so that you'll be able to see much more clear. And there's also this, this deposit to nearby chest, which is very useful as well. Just have to click it, and then all the stuff that's in your inventory will go through this chest which is much closer than me and that all the stuff goes there but if there's already uh, stuff let me take this and put one clay inside it 
Okay, let's put this in the inventory. If you press shift and then left click this merge to nearby chest until it turns blue. If you don't press shift, it turns green, which means it's, it deposits all of the items in your inventory. If you press shift, merge to nearby chest, which means whatever's in your inventory and whatever's inside a chest will put it in there. Look at that, 28. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, expand a little bit more to our home. Because we're cavemen after all. Just a little expansion. So uh, let's get the work stuff and the chopping block. Let's uh, so put that there, there. Then let's put our crafting rack inside that. Hmm. I think I'm gonna mess the, the settings more later after recording for the next video because the amount of brightness the gamma given by the amount of brightness the original settings give isn't really that much right. let's go get this get that oops there's a spider right there can hear it and uh, it doesn't matter let's go get some more mm -hmm. let's put that there I might need to make a flint work plate as well since uh, it's also another tip for you guys which is really good so now, we're gonna make this. Alright. We make a fire stick. Which is made from freaking creepy crawlies. I can hear you. Maybe, maybe. Oh, yeah. Here's also another item which is very nice. Doesn't have durability but really nice as a weapon uh -huh. I guess they're inside somewhere ah oh, there you are what's really good about this spear is we can stat it's enough durability and it's really fast as well. 2.5. Alright, so let's go ahead and see here. Uh, what we're gonna do right now, what we're gonna craft fire sticks and fire. Fire sticks. Oh, I just need to craft one. <laughs> Dumb me. And see here ah yeah the fireplace yeah you're gonna need some rocks twine some sticks the way to craft this hold on let's get some more rocks the only way to wrap craft this three rocks bottom one twine and three sticks oops Uh, there you go. At first, when I re uh, played this mod back, I thought that you'd need fire sticks and then like, do that. But actually, you need to put sticks directly on the thing. Come on, cook. I want you cook. I guess it won't cook. Let's put this thing. Bear meat. It's maple planks. Let's use that. Okay, as you can see, there's a fire animation right there. 
Yeah, let's uh, turn on the smoke animation as well. It's for you guys anyway. I really like this style of animation. There you go. Wolves. Oops. It burned out. Shut up, you stupid wolves. Yeah. I can hear you guys. So it's on the left side. Right. Oops. It's those guys. I'm just hoping I didn't uh, spawn in a island, you know, a world with a lot of islands, because that will really piss me off. And like the first uh, two maps that I played with in this mod pack, there were only what do you call this one that was that had a lot of Darklands, but no Shogoth Lairs. One and another one, a lot of Shogoth Lairs, but no Darklands. And the third uh, map that I created had. Oh, wait. Oh, God. I thought it ate it. But. There you go. Ah, oh, yeah. From what you can see here on this carrot stick right here, if press that, you're gonna be seeing a lot, a list of nutrition, which is gonna be very useful. If you have 100% on all of these, it will give you a certain buffs. 100% on one will give you 2.5 hearts. That's uh, another one. Five hearts, and the sixth one, I mean the third one, seven point five hearts. And after that, you're gonna be getting a buff called resistance. So if you're gonna get another uh hundred percent in nutrition, you're gonna get resistance, ten hearts, plus ten hearts, and also strength, which is gonna be very useful as well. Alright, since we've made that, let's make this hot grill, which is really going to be hard as well because we're going to need smooth zone or if I'm, luck if I'm able to find one, the right blocks, you know, the right and the right and Granite. Those blocks are gonna be what's useful in. Oh, so that I can break this. Can I use this? No, it's useless. I don't even know what's used for that right now. Let's see here. Grab and dirt. There's salt. Some gravel. mud let's try going through some caves on the other side maybe we'll be able to find some uh, useful stuff so did I bring any yeah because if you put flake flint right there it's gonna repair that sadly the rock I mean, no, not the rock. Flint X won't be repaired. Sad. Pretty sad. Using. F oh, yeah. This. Rise. Oh, they are really good. Because no matter if you have hung. I mean, full hunger. Or. Yeah, no matter if you have full hunger. It will not care. It will let you eat it let's start making this as well because I'm gonna need that so I'm gonna gather a lot of gravel I 
for later. Should have made this shovel. Pretty stupid of me. I'll break those later. So we're gonna be be uh, venturing out in the world, trying to find some uh, blocks. We're gonna use to creating that. What do you call this? Hot girl. Let's see if this mountain has it. Nope. Oh, what else? Okay. Oops. Okay. Oh, there it is. There's some pretty useful stuff right there. And you stupid ghouls. So crafty. Come on. Stupid generation. Don't lag on me right now. There you go. I hate these wolves. They... They really are the most annoying kinds. Because they frigging what they call this dodge your every attacks. Alright, let's uh Alrighty then. Let's block it off so that it won't be so frigging annoying when I'm breaking all this. Oops. There. Now I can break these blocks now. Which can be uh, our ticket to making the hot grill. Which is a much better version. Than the fire pit that we made. Let's get a lot as well. I might need to use this water as well. Because some fishes will spawn on the source block and they will fall down. And once they fall down, they go through here. But since there's water in here, they will live. And if we're gonna take advantage of it, uh, have the fish spawn in our base, it'll be easier to kill them if they go, you know, in an empty block. Since they're fish after all, they're gonna need water to breathe. So let's go back to our base. Since we already have R, I mean, and the site, which is my favorite block out of all, we're gonna be. Uh, oops, crafting block there. And uh, there it is. That and that. Now, to craft this thing, you're gonna need that, that, and that. Ding! Da -da -ding, ding! 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 Now we have that. Uh, first things first, we're gonna need clay so that I uh, will be able to what do you call this? Be able to you uh, make more use of the stone grill. We're gonna need this. Craft it like this, a kiln. This thing will give us the need, the thing we need. Uh, to make use of the hot grill much better and to be able to cook things infinitely. I prefer this much better than the furnace that we usually use this you know in Minecraft because you'll need 
a fire source, which is what I call this. You know, coal, wood, and all this other stuff. But this thing does not need one. Oh, freaking hell. Just. Uh, let's do that again. Let's make another one as well. And one more tip in what a lot of people mistakenly do they left click and then right click with fire sticks. That's not how you do it. You just have to press right click once and it will do the stuff you need it to do. Like that. Now. Oh crap. I might need to get some more sticks as well. Yep. Alright, where's this? Yep, finally we got that. Forever fire. There you go. We can break that. Put this low grade charcoal. One on the off hand, one on the main hand, and then Badoosh Forever Fire Can do this here as well. Another frigging flint sticks. Okay. There. One of that. And then stone grill. We can now finally cook food. Finally, yay! So from what you can see here on the stone tools, there's no hole, so I can't really use. I mean, I can't really make farmlands because of it. But there's another way I discovered is to use plow. This thing, uh, if you right, uh, if you place it down and press right click on it, it will make the thing on the back go down. And you need a horse for this. It will create farmland for you if you move it, which I like. Okay, so now let's go ahead and go forward and go through that water source take advantage of it in fishes spawn on it let's do that let's go ahead and make it this first lava They might be up there, but doesn't matter. Okay, let's commence the plan and make use of the water source. Like that, like so. able to use it as well if we have uh, sufficient materials to use shut up wolves you're annoying I'm busy go away uh, they're gonna be very annoying This, this, that, and this side. All right. Huh? We can do this. This way, it won't. 
burn it out. Yes, yeah, so that's smart in its own way. Now fishes will spawn on it. Yeah, we'll go to our base. Oops. Oh, don't go up. Spawn on my base. Go right down here. Flow through there. And die. Because there's no air. Let's see here. Let's move it a little bit more. Now don't judge me, this is how I do stuff. Sometimes that freaking thing so annoying. That should do it. Fish is spawn. Did I immediately once they get here? Smart, right? think it is a smart thing. Let's go ahead and make some more, uh, what do you call this? More just for the blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Oops, rock. Not the person to rock. Item rock. This this thing is now useless. So I'm gonna make it just solely for cobblestone. Just I'm gonna put old spots like that. One, two, three, three more. Because if I'm gonna be mining and all merge the chest, we'll just go there. Which is smart. Smart, right? It's just how to do stuff, okay? And this is for plant stuff. Sapling, saplings. Fine, very close, not very close. But this there. Sapling, wolf meat. I mean eat the wolf meat. The cook. There. Hopefully some fish spawn. Done one source block right there. Let's see here nutritional value, a lot of protein. Protein. Uh, let's take this. Put that there. Bear claws. Or not. Bear. Uh, good item for this. Let's see here. Clay, flint. Rock, this, 
Uh, mesh. I need the tools. Let's put the stuff right here. Um, okay, cobblestone slab. Oops. Forgot the left click. So there's a friend that friend pickaxe. Food access speed your crafting rock goes through its home right there. You attach it and stick. So let's go ahead and progress through some other stuff. So we're gonna need a work blade. I'm gonna need flat twine, sticks, and flake flint, which is made from I think it's this. Oops that and four flip flip yeah let's go ahead and get some more wood as well gonna be, uh, build a proper base with the proper stuff to progress through this uh tree and I think I'm just gonna find it until later until I get I get the map until I find a what do you call this a village because once you find a village you'll be able to find a cartographer which is the one that sells the maps Let me test some stuff. Does the Venus flytrap eat items? Yeah, it eats items. Crap. Guess it won't be that very useful for that. Huh? Too bad. It looks kinda useful though. Making traps. Use the trap if it doesn't drop items. That would be too useful, wouldn't it? And one reason why I needed this flint work blade is to do this. Oops. Craft it together with this so that we'll be able to get the bark. It's because the bark is useful for other stuff, which is other crafting for this and this but I can't make a proper chest yet unless I get the dark lance wood which I'll need the dark lance first all right I'm gonna think of one last thing before we go let's check here let's make some Blech. Stone tools just to finish the episode. Ugh. It's fine, it's not required, but just for the sake of advancements, I'm just gonna do it. Blech. I need bone as well so that I'll be able to get the achievements on these things. As yeah, so what you can see here, this is the stuff that I need lost but now found. I'm gonna uh, just need a villager, a cartographer, or a librarian to be able to get this one. Which, first things first, I need to find one. A village. A village that is. Okay, let's put that. Okay, the bark. Why did I put that there? Okay, let's uh, get rock. Make another chest. Oops. 
<laughs> Sounded like a melody. Oxtra block. Twine. Let's keep it at this. I may need the stuff. Okay. Let's see here. Let's make. I can't make that yet. Well, I think I guess that's gonna be it for the episode. Thanks for watching, guys. This is Legaton. Goodbye.